We just finished up 2022, and it's definitely been a roller coaster ride for the housing market. So in this video, let's take a look back at the final quarter of 2022 to see how home prices did in the community of Trilogy Glen Ivy. Hi, my name is Casey and I'm a local realtor. I also live in one of the 55 and older communities here in Corona. And on this channel, I share information and tips about the local housing market. So if you like the information in this video, I'd love if you hit the like and subscribe buttons below. Okay, so let's jump right in and take a look back at home prices in the community of Trilogy at Glen Ivy for the fourth quarter of 2022. And this includes homes sold between October 1st and December 31st of 2022. The first number I'd like to share with you is the average sales price. The average sales price of a home in Trilogy was $612,638, with prices ranging from a low of $490,000 all the way up to a high of $695,000. And if you look back at prices during the third quarter of 2022, you'll see that the average sales price was $666,269. So home prices for single-family homes in the community of Trilogy did drop 8.7%. And although this isn't great news for homeowners, it's not as bad as many people expected. And this drop was caused by a few things. First, interest rates have gone up significantly during 2022. We started off the year with rates right around 3%, but now they're right around 6.5%. So the rates have more than doubled. And this increase in mortgage rates is making it much less affordable for home buyers. The second reason for the drop is the fact that real estate typically slows down during the months of November and December. And this is due to the holidays. It's very common to see buyers and sellers both pull back for the holidays and then jump right back in after the new year. So we are expecting the market to pick up as we move into the new year. And the highest price home sold in Trilogy was located at 9244 Robinson Lane. This home had two bedrooms plus an office two bathrooms, and 1,888 square feet of living space. The home had a two-car garage and had been nicely upgraded throughout, including the kitchen and both bathrooms. And this home sold for $695,000. Next, let's take a look at the number of homes that were actually sold. During the fourth quarter of 2022, there were a total of 16 homes sold. And this is up slightly from the third quarter when there were a total of 14 homes sold in the community. Another important number to look at is the average days on market. This simply means how long the home was actually available for sale before an offer was accepted. And during the fourth quarter of 2022, the average number of days to sell a home in Trilogy was 43 days. Now this is almost exactly the same as the third quarter when homes were selling in just 44 days. Now in most areas of Southern California, it's taking much longer for homes to sell, but the market here in Trilogy has remained very stable. And finally, I wanna share with you the number of homes currently for sale. Right now, there are 17 homes for sale in the community, and the average asking price of these homes is 643,282, with prices ranging from a low of 510 up to a high of 849,000. And again, if you compare this to the third quarter, these numbers remained almost exactly the same, with the average sales price back then at 647,243. So just a quick recap, the average sales price of a home in Trilogy at Glen Ivy was 612,638. The highest priced home sold was priced at $695,000. There were 16 homes sold during the fourth quarter of 2022, and the average number of days it took to sell a home was 43 days. And finally, there are 17 homes currently for sale in the community. So we definitely saw some changes in the housing market as we ended up 2022. But even with a drop in the average sales price of 8.7%, the housing market in Trilogy at Glen Ivy is doing much better than many other communities in Southern California. And we're starting to see some positive signs for the housing market too. Mortgage rates have leveled off and have dropped slightly in the past few months. And the numbers are showing that the market is slowly returning to a more normal pattern. And that's definitely better than the craziness that we saw during the past year and a half. Now, I hope you found this information helpful. I try to share important information about the housing market so you can keep up to date with home prices here in Corona. And if you're interested in seeing a complete list of all the homes currently for sale in the community of Trilogy at Glen Ivy or across the freeway in the community of Terramore, you can click on the link in the description below.